everybody, Brian the Wild Armenian, a rat ride carport builder, mechanic, real estate investor, whatever you want to call me. Don't call me late for lunch. Yeah, about that. You know, I'll tell you what. <laughs> Sometimes, I don't know. I, I, I think I need another vacation from my retirement. I get so busy and I get I get involved in my projects here and I got a lot of things going on and just that way, you know, and I, I think ahead of myself and and uh, wow. And then a lot of things bug me too because, you know, I can I can make some side money, side hustle, but I don't want to, you know. And then I'm when I'm working on this stuff, it's kinda like God, just think of the money I could make. And then I got to remember, you know, you're retired, dummy. <laughs> it's like, and I start thinking about, so I know, you know, me and the wife, we bought some property and um, it was been a couple of months now, I guess. And it's an investment property, but you know what? We might sell. We're talking about selling the, the, the five acres and moving over to the acre downsizing. And that's something to look forward to, too. And then a lot of things, it's, it's about, um, hmm, I guess, you know, when I was, I think a lot of financial advisors and say, they say, start planning in your first last five years before you retire, or maybe 10 years, whatever it is. But, you know, and I was doing that. I was, you know, gearing up. I'm sure a lot of y'all have done that too. And, you know, I'm getting ready for retirement. Maybe 10 years ago, started thinking about it. And then five years ago, really pulling in the strings, you know, and but, you know, now that we're retired, now we're thinking about another phase, too, uh, downsizing, you know, as we get older, you know. And, and just because I'm retired, you know, and I don't have to work anymore, now i got to start thinking of the other phase. And I call it the other phase of my uh, retirement, or me and my wife. You know, she's still working, and uh, she's going to work for a few more years, and then she's going to give it up full time, you know, retirement. But, you know, we were thinking about downsizing. And really thinking hard about it because it gets to a point, you know, I've seen it happen to my mom. You know, you end up going to the nursing home, you know, you have to sell everything, all your possessions. And man, my mom had a lot of stuff and it's just stuff, you know, it becomes that. But then what do you do with it? You know, at the time when it happens, you know, so hopefully we can start seeing telltale signs with ourselves to know when to let go of stuff, you know, and we, we don't, we're not. Let me let me rephrase what I'm talking about. We didn't get the property because of that. We're kicking it around what I'm getting at. But it's a possibility. It's a reality, just like death and taxes. OK, and it's something to look at. So we're planning ahead on that also. And uh, we're very aware of it, you know, and it's just like making a will. You know, uh, you got to make a will. You don't have to, but it's planning. You know, you don't want to die today or tomorrow, but, you know, you plan for the worst. And that's what we're talking about. You know, we're we're going to downsize our life. We don't have to do it right now, tomorrow. Even though I was uh, with a couple of land clearers, we're looking at the property and they're giving me, you know, they're going to shoot me a quote on that. And so we're, we're getting estimates. So uh, we're planning on it. We're, we're making, I guess, baby steps towards it. Something to look forward to, you know, uh, and, and to look into. So basically, um, I'm going to say... Uh, I'm at my first phase of my retirement, and then we'll probably go into the second phase, especially when the wife retires, you know, when that is, whenever that is, you know, maybe a couple of years, uh, she goes full time, and then uh, then we'll work on winding it down, and I'll start getting rid of some of this old rusty metal too, you know, so long I could be doing that, my hands are getting worse as it is now. You know, uh, arthritis, arthritis is kicking in, you know, so, you know, I'm learning to work with it and stretching and all that kind of stuff. But, you know, the reality is going to happen. I'm going to get older. So, you know, that's something to, something to think about. So uh, with that, God bless you guys. Really, I really appreciate you uh, coming in, checking my channel. Uh, like and subscribe. Uh, give me a thumbs up. Uh, become a subscriber. Somewhere on there, you click it in there and give me a thumbs up please, and share it, and like I always say, you know, a lot of things are important to me today, you know, my God, you know, my family, my wife, my kids, my country, and you, Pope, you, Pope, Popes, ooh, <laughs> you folks, excuse me, and you're very important, and please, by all means, take care of yourself, God bless you.